So, I'll be showing the materials that we're going to build the pie top. The instructions. So I have set up the screws that in, with inside the pie tub hub will be needing a nut and a brass screw. You can see that I put three, three of them screwed in. I'll be screwing the last one in. The brass screw has to go under the pie tub. And the nut right there to make this an important thing for this pie top you have to provide your own raspberry pie we are going to use the raspberry pie 3 the interesting part of this raspberry pie 3 is this has its own uh, uh, built-in Wi-Fi. Also, it has Bluetooth. You as well have to ha uh, have to download the operate uh, operating system for this. Well, next is screwing in the screws using the brass and the nut. And you can see I have put in three of them. I'll be pl uh, putting the last one in. As well, you got plugged in your SD card. Where you can find it is down here. Next step is having the lid and uh, base. You can see that we had these under the base. How you can take them out is through these holes. Bye. And they also are magnetic, so they're easily uh, take them, uh, uh, taking them out. Next, you can see this metal part at both sides of the lid. And we have to put them through here. So, while they're connecting, right after we uh, plug, uh, put in the lid, there are screws at the end. We'll be using the screwdriver that they provide us and making it tighter that the lid doesn't fall next is by uh, is using the hub where it should be at is the left side because you can see well you can see uh, putting it in 
and the wire right here goes here. So gently put it in. I have already put in the Raspberry Pi inside. It has to be at the right side of the laptop. As well, I have screwed in the silver screws under the brass screws that you have to gently screw them in. They both have four screws Next, the last step is to put in the magnet magnetics in here. Next is using the three cables. I'll be putting in the HDMI cable first. First take out the safety pins out. And I'll be connecting the hub with the Pi. Next, I'll be connecting the micro USB cable. The USB will be connected to the hub. And the last will be the breakout cable. When applying all these cables, I tugged in the break, uh, breakout cable. Next is plugging in the, t uh, the keyboard. We will be having two cables that this power control cable will be connected through here and there. And the second cable is the keyboard cable that this will be connected through the key, uh, keyboard and the end is a USB connecting through the Pi after connecting the cables through the keyboard we connect it through the computer And how the laptop will be connected is push it in.
And the best part of this laptop is taking this out. Put it through the little hole. And the best part of everything is Next is just messing with the computer and having fun.